All right, guys. Stacy Lynn back with MMA Futures here with Brandon Thatch, current UFC fighter. Brandon, what have you been up to? We haven't seen you in the UFC cage since November 2013. Uh, just a lot of rehab. I had some uh, sh some body issues. My shoulders jacked up. Uh, just going through rehab. Just getting getting healthy. Getting my body strong. Now you're here in Lincoln, Nebraska. What brings you down these way? Uh, I had a fighter out of uh, Team Elevation, Sonny Yon, that, that fought an amateur fighter, so I'm out here cornering for him. So what do you think about the MMA scene so far in Lincoln, Nebraska? Uh, great great scene, a little little different from what I'm used to, but uh, all in all, a great scene, good crowd, good fight so far. It's a great show with RFA. Now, I know that you're expecting to be making your third appearance in the UFC. What's it been like going from a stage like RFA to the UFC? Uh, in the cage, it's it's about the same, but uh, the the hype, the the crowd, the prom, prom, promotion, the production of the UFC is uh, it's it's there's there's they're second to none for a reason. Now you're fighting in the 170 division, which is stacked in talent. Um, who would you want to fight as your next fight in the UFC? Um, right now, I'm just I'm just I'll fight whoever they put in front of me. You know, I, I'm not in a position where I can choose any of my opponents. So whoever they put in front of me, I'm going to fight, and and hopefully I, I'm I'm impressive and. And I finish, you know, that's that's all. I, I don't really have anybody in particular I want to fight. I just want to climb that ladder. I'd, I'd like to fight a top 10 guy if possible, but until then, I'm just whoever they put in front of me. Now, tomorrow night, we know uh, Gustafson and Manawar are facing off. Who do you have winning that fight? Uh, it's a tough one, man. Both both guys are tough. It, it'll, be, it'll be interesting to see who comes out on top. All right, guys, this is Brandon Thatch, current UFC fighter. Uh, give him a follow on Twitter, and thank you guys for joining us with MMA Futures. Brandon, thank you so much.